Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Um, today I'm going to make a video all about my dream game features or things that I would think would be really cool to be added into Alicia Online. Um, so I would like to begin with to saying that I am not expecting any of these to be implemented in the game, nor am I forcing them into the game or like pressuring the devs to add them. They're just some ideas I think would be cool and that uh, yeah, I know that it would be difficult to be put into the game, so don't think I'm like trying to say that they should be added to the game. I just think that they'd be really cool in the game. So yeah. So um, let's begin with some racing stuff. One thing that I think would be really cool is voice chat. Now when I talk about this with other people, they usually give me a mixed reaction. Um, but I don't know, the idea of joining a room and being yelled at about how bad I am at playing the game or hearing a different language appeals to me. <laughs> um, but in all seriousness, adding voice chat would probably make the game a lot more toxic, so we're probably actually better off without it. <laughs> um, so second thing is spectating. Being able to watch your friends race or watching a room you're waiting to join would be really cool. Um, I personally would love to watch my friends beat some random pe some random people. I would think it'd be a really neat little feature. Okay, um, on to some horse stuff. Firstly, I think it'd be really cool to have different mains, like braided mains in the game. Um, like if your horse had a long mane, there'd be an option to braid it, and then over time, while you race, it would like fall out and become normal again. And so, like braiding it would be like a cute little like cleaning option. I think that'd be quite cool. Um, secondly, would be custom <laughs> Next, customizable wings. Oh my gosh, if they added this, I would lo lose my shit. I assume it wouldn't be too hard to add, but I wouldn't really know, so... But, like, cause when Halloween comes around, we get the bat wings, and it's super cool. I wouldn't- it wouldn't even have to be fancy, just if we were to get, like, different colors or shapes would be really cool and we'd be able to buy them at like the shop and stuff under like the accessories maybe i think that'd be really cool more horse coats would always be nice um i don't really have a specific coat i really want but it's always nice to get new ones um this leads into more horse breeds we all know that there was a donkey and shire i think in elishi online 2.0 It'd be nice to have some variety, like some Frisians or actual ponies, but in all honesty, I don't really mind the one breed, so it's quite nice. So it'd, be, it'd just be cool to have more. Now on to some ranch and character stuff. Emotes. Emotes would be very cool. Like when your character like whistles, it would be like that, but it like waves or points or something. It'd be... It would make meeting people in your ranch a bit more engaging and fun. Also, a dance emote would be amazing. <laughs> I guess that leads to, of course, walking around. Another infamous thing from Alicia 2.0 that I'm pretty sure the devs have already said they won't be putting in. Uh, don't quote me on that, but I've, I've heard it from somewhere they're planning on not adding it in. Um, like emotes, I think it would make meeting people a lot cooler and add a whole new level to the game. Uh, player housing. Another thing that if they added, I would lose my shit. I literally love player housing. It's one of my favorite things in many MMOs I've played. They already have the building that could be the house. It'd be cool if we could put in furniture and have like people inside our house, which I guess would require walking around. I just love the idea of having like little parties in our houses or someone making a clubhouse for a guild. Next is ranch pets. These wouldn't be anything special, but I'm thinking that they could be similar to the cat that's already in the ranch. We would be able to buy them for the shop or get them from achievements. I It would also be cool if we could have like a maximum of 10, so there'd be like 10 little like dogs and cats running around. That'd be quite cool. Or another idea from this is you could use the pets we already get from eggs and just you could be able to like choose like a couple of them that you could just have like walking around. I think that'd be pretty sick. Next is a meadow online ranch. I know we already have the flower fields, but I think it'd be really cool to have a nice big field to ha to hang out in. Um, it would have like flowers and grass everywhere, and maybe have like a big tree in the middle. It would also it could also have like the, like the houses like like the like the original like ranch house to the side, and they could put the little like fireplace next to it, and we could have like a cute little like place to hang out there. I think they're really cute. 
Um, speaking of the town, I think it'd also be cool to have, like, the town in, like, the distance. That would be very cool. This idea mainly comes from being able to go out of the bounds in the town and just wander around, like, that big area. We don't really have many big areas to run around in in AO, so I think it'd be cool. When I say, like, big, I don't mean, like, star stable map big, but I mean, like, maybe if it was the size of, like, the home ranch, just, like, um, it's, like, flattened with, like, only slight hills. Um, different skin colors. I think we all could agree that it'd be nice to have some diversity in the game. I'm not sure how hard this would be to implement, but it'd be a really nice feature. It's one of my biggest critiques of Star Stable as well. And last but not least, Alicia Lore! I'm not completely- <laughs> I'm not completely serious about this one, but I have so many questions. Why do bunnies run the economy? Why do the horses have ghost wings? And why do all the horses have so many opinions? Is Thomas my grandfather? Does this dog have a name? Alicia, explain! But yeah, I don't know. It'd be nice to have a bit more backstory. It's not completely necessary. I know, it'd just be cool, I guess. If you guys have any theories about Alicia's backstory in the world of Alicia, leave them in the comments. I'd love to see them. Also, if lore already exists, I'm not sure, no, I don't know about, please uh, let comment down below as well. But yeah, those are pretty much all of my ideas at the moment. Uh, I'll, let me know if you guys have any ideas or cool features that you think would be just cool to have in the game. Comment them down below. Love to see your ideas. But yeah, uh, that's it for me today. Thank you guys so, so much for watching, and I'll see you all later. Bye, guys!